And DPP lawmakers are questioning why Taipei is allowed to sell water from its own plentiful supply to New Taipei, parts of which are set to undergo water rationing next week. They called on Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe to share water from Feitui Reservoir with the surrounding area as a way of heading off looming water shortages across northern Taiwan. While seasonally dry weather has pushed the water level at Taoyuan Shimen Reservoir to a dangerously low level, Feitui Reservoir in New Taipei is still a healthy 80 percent full. It's a situation that's frustrating the DPP's representatives from New Taipei. Feitui Reservoir is obviously located in New Taipei, and all the responsibility for enforcing water conservation measures and building restrictions lies with New Taipei. But when New Taipei needs water, we have to spend money to buy it from the Taipei city government, which makes us feel that there's a serious environmental injustice. The lawmaker representing the Taoyuan district containing Shimen Reservoir complained that Feitui's consumption level hasn't exceeded 30 percent in 10 of the past 15 years, while Taoyuan experienced eight different rounds of rationing during that period. We know that over 40 percent of publicly listed companies in Taiwan have set up factories or operations in Taoyuan. But the constant water cuts here have forced many of those companies to stop taking orders when they don't have any water to use. And that's already taken a serious toll on economic development. Looking at the water level at Shimen Reservoir and the rationing that's soon to come into effect across Taoyuan Xinzhu and New Taipei's Banqiao Xinzhuang and Linkou districts, an area which includes Taipei Mayor Ke's own hometown, I believe that he will, in the spirit of regional cooperation, share water resources across both reservoirs in these tough times. Together we can solve northern Taiwan's water shortage crisis. DPP lawmakers called on Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe to support the central government's reallocation of water rights as a way to head off the looming water shortages currently threatening northern Taiwan.